Hello everybody, this is Uppish, and welcome back to Batman Arkham Asylum. In the last video, we uh, discovered Harley Quinn twice. The first time she tried to drop a freaking elevator on our head, <laughs> and the second time she was uh, protected behind this uh, freaking electric, uh, electric wall. So yeah, without further ado, let's continue. I hear you. I'm going. Why does he need the doctors? I've got to save them. Oh, new character by unlock, Killer Croc. Born with a rare mutation that made his skin green and scaly, and grew his body to gro grotesque proportions, Waylon Jones was raised by an alcoholic aunt and bullied relentlessly for his appearance. He briefly worked as a carnival freak under the name Killer Croc, but his misanthropy grew as his be bestial nature pushing him to, the, to a life of crime. As his physical condition and mental state deteriorate, Killer Croc becomes a more bestial foe, increasingly detached from humanity. There's more than just his mind changing, you fools. Look at him! Look at him! He's growing actual scales. He has teeth sticking out of his gums, or sticking out of his freaking lips. He doesn't have any lips anymore. Seriously, look at him. Okay, let's see where we go first. All patients, please remain calm and move slowly to their accommodation. Let me introduce you all to the sterling work of our new enterprise. Oh, hush. Whatever your name is, Warden Sharp. Alright, I'm going in the right direction, apparently. Oh, there's another trophy. Awesome. All right, let's go to surgery first. Our goal is to cure the more unfortunate specimens, the weak, those not Shh. Rumors persist that Tommy Elliot operates something or other. What was that? Rumors persist that Tommy Elliot operates in Arkham. Can it be true? Tommy Elliot. Who's Tommy Elliot? Who the heck is Tommy Elliot? Batman. Don't speak. You're safe now. But but it's a trap. I know. Just not for me. <gasps> it's true! You really are the world's greatest detective. How did you do that, Bats? Oh, what the hell? Get down there, boys. See if he can All right. detect Oop. the impression Oop, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to miss that. Come on, get smacked. Ooh. Ooh. Nope, don't even try it. Ooh, 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 that one hurt more. Ooh, 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 ooh. Gosh darn it. Ooh, good thing I got him. Ooh, boy. Quit pulling crap up off the walls. Ooh, that sounded like it was crunchy. <laughs> got, got them all. 
Don't get too full of yourself, Bats. I'm just softening you up. Think of this as a preview to the main event. You'll see. Hmm. Now let's get Please, him out. Get me out of this thing. I'm sorry. I tried to tell you. I couldn't speak. Relax, you're safe now. I can handle these low-life thugs. Yeah, you might want to get yourself out of that chair, though. Who knows when they're gonna be come if they're gonna be coming back for you. <laughs> and I can't enter that for some reason. Oh wait. Um. Maybe if I break it. No. Can I grapple up? Oh yes, yes I can. So I don't even need to use the little pathway there. Something about some Elliot guy. Boss, it's done. The room is full of gas and Captain Hook is stuck in there. Thing is, Razor didn't get out in time. He's stuck in there too. Oh, that'll teach him to dilly dally. Don't let anyone out of there. Even Razor. I don't like failures. I can't leave yet. I need to save the doctors. Don't cry, Cash. You're right where we want. I didn't even mean to do that. Can I maybe jump up on this guy? Come on, knock him out. Come on, let me knock him out. Give me knock a knockout moment. Okay then, I guess that works too. How do I turn off the smoke though? Gosh, what happened? There was an alarm in the when I heard someone shouting about Doc lying on the floor. When I went to the house, the room was flooded with gas. These doors locked down. We can't get out. Don't know how long we can last. How brave. Let's give Mr. Cash a great big hand. He could use one. Huh. <laughs> You'll be laughing out of your butt when I get out of here. Lighten up, Holmes. I'm just messing with you. <laughs> Can't wait to return the favor. Leave it, Cash. Can you control the ventilation system in there? Try it. It's a no-go. He disabled remote access. I'll find a way. And now I can enter this vent because I think this is where I need to go. But it wasn't letting me go. That's it, man. Okay. Where do I go from here? Oh my, oh my, escape. No, dang it. I didn't want to do that. <laughs> there we go. That sucks though, I feel sorry. I feel a little sorry for him. I actually feel a little sorry for him. Aaron Cash, one of the most senior and respected guards at Arkham, Cash is only afraid of one inmate, Killer Croc, who severely wounded Cash once during a riot at the asylum. Cash remains determined, however, to keep the asylum's inmates under control and to conquer his fears of Croc. Hmm, interesting. Now we can get into that room and get whatever that, uh, that cassette up. That cassette was. Patient interview 21. Patient's name is Edward Nigma, also known as the Riddler. So, Edward, Warden Sharp tells me you've been leaving threatening riddles scrawled on the asylum walls. Again. 
One would have to be severely paranoid to read threats into harmless riddles, Dr. Young. May I test you with one? Very well. What is it that walks on four legs, then two legs, and finally three legs? A human being. As a baby, it crawls on four legs. As an adult, it walks on two. And in later years, it uses a cane. <laughs> Good try. But the answer to all three is a baby. True, it crawls on all fours, but cut off its legs and it can only wiggle on two limbs. Give it a crutch, it can hobble around on three. You see? That's horrible. How can you even joke about that? Easily, Doctor. It's not my baby. Ah, uh, yeah, it's creepy. Uh, let's talk to him. I shouldn't have left an intensive treatment. I would have made sure that freak stayed where he belonged. Oh, okay then. Alright then. I guess there's nothing else to talk about. Still can't enter any of these vents up here on the walls though. Maybe I'll be able to do that eventually. I honestly don't understand why of all things this is lagging so bad because we've been in larger rooms and it did not lag anywhere near this bad. Seriously. Why are you doing this? Haha! <laughs> Got them both. What's going on? They were talking like they were in control. Is it true the Joker escaped? Unfortunately, yes. But not for long. I'd been studying Joker's case for months when he broke out. The warden was very specific he wanted Joker cured. Bad publicity will affect his campaign for mayor. That'll be the least of it. God, I almost forgot. They said they were moving through the facility, hunting down the other doctors. Not a problem. All staff have been rescued. You'll be safer if you remain here. Awesome. Well, all of them are saved. <laughs> and all no more lag with this room. Time to continue following Harley Quinn and Gordon's trail. Hmm. Door blocked. That sucks. <laughs> Is there anything I need in here? I don't see anything. Oh, so there's, there is a trophy up here. Of course you found that one easy. You were supposed to. Yeah, because most of your trophies are locked behind grates, which I can't get behind most of the time. Welcome to Arkham Asylum. Our staff are here to help you. Another one. Inside seats for the big event. Harley's bringing the popcorn. Oh, I can't wait. <laughs> Remember, a happy patient is a quiet patient. Welcome to Arkham Asylum. Our staff are here to help you. When Amadeus Arkham built this fine institution, few would have believed it could be the premier psychiatric evaluation and rehabilitation center. Everyone knows the stories of huh. various so-called That was easy. Huh. Did you find them? Are they okay? Yes, they're safe now. Batman, we've got another problem. I need to get back to the mansion. All my research notes are there. We can't risk Joker getting his hands on them. It's not safe, Doctor. The island's a war zone. You won't stand a chance. It's my life's work. You really don't have the authority to... I'll get her there, Batman. You ask me, it's about time for a little payback. I don't like it, but... Who called the elevator? It wasn't us. It's coming from the lower floor. Cash, take Dr. Young. Get her notes and then find somewhere safe to hold up. Everyone else, go to the observation room. Barricade yourselves in. In here somewhere. Spread out. Ooh. Got ourselves some more boys to deal with. It's not too smart for you guys to be spreading out. Because I can get you a little easier that way. Oh, but none of the bodies are still hanging from the gargoyles. Makes sense if there's gargoyles literally inside the place, which makes... No sense to me why they are. Come on, come on, come on. 
And whack. Right trigger Y. Climb, 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 climb. Unseen. Ha ha. Okay. I found someone over here. <laughs> Now we can actually go down the elevators. Or the elevator. Haha, finally we get to go down. Down, down into the Too depths. Easy. Oh, think about it. I got you trapped in a little metal box. Hanging precariously over a deadly drop. What say I just blow the emergency brakes and drop you like a sack of puppies? Say good night, bats. Boom! <laughs> Only kidding. Got a few more surprises in store for you. Prepare to face your fears. All of them! <laughs> oh my. Oh, and that's creepy. Oh my, are you going to take your hat off to Harley Bats? What? Hat off. Hat off? Ew. The thought of that is disgusting. Honestly, the thought of Joker in a thong. Ew. I know, it sounds weird for me to be thinking of that, but when you put it in a person's head, they can't help but think of it. Oh my, that's actually kind of creepy. I think I know exactly who we're facing this time. It's not gonna be Killer Croc. I think he comes later. <laughs> I'm sorry, Jim. Barbara, I... I'm sorry. I was too late. I'm sorry. The number you've dialed isn't available. Please leave a message after the tone. I'm sorry, what? Barbara, are you there? Please hang up your phone. I'm sorry, what? Um... The morgue. Ooh, ew bugs, ew bugs, no, ew. Makes my skin crawl. Alright, we're in the morgue. Open body bag. Father, you should have stopped doing son. Like a man. Hmm.
That is so creepy, and who's the third person on the table? That is creepy. Oh my. Just, uh... I'm sorry, why is the morgue torn to pieces? The morgue is torn to pieces. Boss fight. Got move, 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 move. This thing is acting really weird. Hopefully, it just stays acting in like side scroller rules. We just gotta move. Hurry up and move. Now crouch. Okay. Now move. Climb. Climb. Climb up, climb up, climb up, climb up, climb up. Get up there! Look around you. These are the broken fragments of your mind. Woo! Alright, use the explosive gel. Now move out of the way quickly. Oh, dang it! Didn't mean to do that. Oh, son of a gun. Careful, careful, careful. Ooh, that's an ugly freaking face. And just move. 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 Whee. Ooh. Now, let's use it. What silent killer of the oceans can be found in a tiny jar? I don't know what that means. Tiny jar. Can you hear me? Bruce, what's going on? Oracle, I'm okay. What happened? I lost contact. Are you sure you're alright? Have you found my dad? I'm fine. Had a little run-in with Scarecrow. Slowed me down. I'll get back to you in a bit. Oh, a little killer in a jar. Subject too small. How do I... Ah! I forgot I could do this. The Great White Shark. Don't what? get too full of yourself, Dark Knight. It only gets harder from here. Oh! Character bio. A crooked financer who stole millions of dollars. Warren White thought he'd scored a legal victory when his sanity pl insanity plea went through. When he got to Arkham Asylum, he realized his mistake. Driven insane by the other inmates, he was too disfigured by an encounter with, by, with Mr. Freeze. That left him without hair, a nose, ears, or lips. Calling himself the Great White Shark, he filed his teeth into fangs to more perfectly resemble his new namesake. Putting his financial skills to use, he has become a major player in Gotham's underground crime scene, running a number of rackets from his cells, his cell in Arkham. Hmm. Interesting. Never heard of him before. Seriously an interesting character. Okay, here we go. Your precious police commissioner is just through the glass. Take a look. 
Carly's under strict instructions to kill the old man if any of my guys even think you're in the room. They're patrolling down there. I've told them all you're on the way. So here's the deal. If you can find a way to get to Harley without anyone realizing, I'll give you your next present. Fail, and the old codger dies. Hell, I may even give you Harley. <laughs> it looks like you could use a new sidekick. Ah. Don't you start doing that mass lag crap. Rescue Gordon without being detected. Ooh, this is gonna be a challenge now. Secret map. Secrets so, reveal on map. You have given it and taken in my map. I hope it proves useful. Huh. That's gonna be useful, I think. Oh. There's little things hidden around here, huh? That's new. Oh, we got a couple new ones. Scarecrow and Bane. Imprisoned from birth to serve his dead father's sentence, Bane was re raised inside the horrific environs of a Santa Prisca prison. His only friend in the heck hole was a teddy bear he named Osito. Finding solace in smuggled books and meditation, he developed incredible powers of concentration. When he was subjected to concentration... Oh, wait, when he was subjected to military experiments using a steroid codenamed Venom, his Iron Forge will helped him survive when other test subjects had died, and he managed to escape. Determined to prove his worth, he sought out Batman and broke the Dark Knight's spine. But Batman recovered and managed to best Bane, cutting off the precious Venom supply that transforms B Bane into a superhuman. Ooh, gruesome. Haunted and bullied as a youth, Jonathan Crane vowed to overcome his fears through the study of psychology and biochemistry. Kicked out of his university for experimenting on human subjects, Crane then adopted the identity of the Scarecrow and armed himself with a specialized fear-inducing gas that makes a person's deepest phobias become frighteningly real. His ongoing criminal reign of terror makes him one of Batman's most psychologically dangerous foes. Hmm. I already knew that, but that's still really interesting. And the designs they give for these guys? Ooh, top notch. Seriously top notch. You know, you really should color that hair of yours. All that gray makes you look so old. You think Ooh. you got the same matters to me? Okay, Riddler Trophy. That was one of the easy ones. And come on. <laughs> you took longer than I thought. He's out of control. He's trying to prove something. I'm not sure I can stop him this time. You'll do it. Batman, listen. We're not alone. He's got something else down there. I don't know what it is. What a blab about! Spoiling the surprise. Be quiet. Oh, am I getting to you? Am I? Good. <laughs> You're going to love this next bit. It wants Dr. Young's login. Never mind that. Get behind me. Now. Bane. I thought he broke out of Blackgate. Cut me. Down. Who did this to you? Dr. Young, the Bruja. She drained the venom from my blood. Must stop her. Sorry, Hasbane. The good doctor won't be a problem much longer. How do you like my puppet? What say we cut him down? <laughs>
Now, how the heck that didn't break Batman's bones, I have no freaking clue. I need to get him to smack into a wall or something. Come on, chase me down. Whoop. And smack him, smack him, smack him. Ooh. Ooh. Ow, ow. I was meaning to dodge those. Why can't I move? Why can't I move? Move, move. Ah, I keep forgetting how to dodge. He's gonna end up killing me. Oh no. Oh no. Move. Oh, mother of heck. Oh. The bat is broken. <laughs> and he hits the wall. Now let's smack him a couple times. And yes. Yes, finally. Finally. Oh my. Where's Quinn? Gone. Must have gotten loose while Bane was throwing you around. We need to get you off the island. I'm not a rookie. I can handle myself. I will break you, Batman! Then the Bruja! No, Bane. This time, I break you! Jim, get back to the mainland. It's too dangerous here. I don't like leaving you here. Radio claims he's planted bombs all over Gotham. Gotham will panic. You're needed there. We're ready to go now, sir. Bane called Dr. Young Bruja. What does it mean? It's Spanish for witch. Oracle, go through the city's computers. Pull up all you can find on Dr. Young. I'll go through anything you find once I get to the cave. A bat cave on Arkham Island? I built it years ago. It's best to plan ahead for situations like this. How'd you manage to keep this a secret? It's me, remember? So do you think Dr. Young's been experimenting with Venom? The same chemical that turns Bane into that animal? Yes, I'm worried. Bane seemed even more powerful than usual. Joker wants the Venom, and that can only be trouble. I'm heading to Dead Man's Point in Arkham North. I'll contact you once I'm in the Batcave. And I'm going to try and get there before we end the video. Oh, I see. So there's a cave entrance back here. Awesome. Yes, another Amadeus Arkham thing. My family's blood ran through the heart of Gotham. We were doctors, politicians, and teachers. We have been the organ cleaning the arterial filth from the city. We have been its servants, giving all to protect it. And still it has chosen to hurt us. Ah. Uh, he seems like a very... strange fellow. I don't know how to explain it. Um, philosophical? Is that the word I'm looking for? Yeah, I think that's the word I'm looking for. Philosophical. And we are here now, I think.
countermeasures. Security deactivated. Awesome. Wow. That's pretty interesting here. I mean, just seriously impressive. Oh. On. Wee. <laughs> wow, it really is like a bat cave. Look at the deck here. Dr. Young was heading up a project. It was big, lots of external funding. Here are the last notes she filed. I can't make sense of it. What does it mean? Looks like she was experimenting on the Arkham patients. This new chemical only barely resembles the original venom compound. There are a number of changes that appear to amplify the strength of the drug. Multiple references to a Titan formula. Even a small amount could trigger a venom-like transformation in the host, eliminating the need for the storage tank Bane requires. Hang on. These notes aren't complete. The formula is missing. That must be the secret Dr. Young is hiding. If Joker gets his hands on this, he will create an army of a thousand Banes. My god. Is Joker crazy enough to do that? What am I saying? You've got to stop him. Anyways, guys, I'm going to end this video here. Hopefully you've enjoyed. Leave your thoughts down in the comments below. Gosh, two boss fights. Wait, technically two and a half? Yeah, I'd say about two and a half freaking boss fights in this video. <sighs> Mind blown. <laughs> like, this is going to be edited down kind of a lot. The video might be up to like 30 minutes because, well, uh, there's a lot to be in it, okay? There's a lot of the, into this video. Oh, gosh dang cars. Someone's setting off a car alarm. Anyways, seriously, hopefully you guys have enjoyed, and if you did, hit the like button down below. It helps out the channel a lot, seriously, hitting my like button. And the more likes I see, the more I, I see that you guys actually do enjoy this content. And not only that, but share it with a friend or family above the age of 13. As you can see, these, these games are not meant for children. Okay? So yeah, hopefully you have enjoyed. And without further ado, see you in the next one. Bye bye